Anna, tell me again, why are we visiting Elsa's new ice palace? Well, Kristoff, Elsa said she made a bigger and better ice palace and wants us to stay the night. I don't know about this, Anna. I don't like the cold and ooh, that ice palace. Why can't Elsa just make a nice, cozy log cabin? Come on, you know Elsa can't do that. She has ice powers. Anyway, Kristoff, look around. We're here. Hey, Anna. Hey, Kristoff. Welcome to my new palace. Holy cow. Hey, Elsa. Is it all right if we live with you forever? Oh, so you love my new ice palace, huh? Wait, um, Kristoff? Kristoff, where did he go? Um, nom, 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 Oh, there you are, Kristoff. <laughs> that figures. Hi, everybody. It's All Toy Collector here with... Toby! And today we're reviewing the KidCraft Frozen Ice Palace. This is brand new and I found it at Costco. Doesn't this castle look amazing? First off, I would like to thank my husband because he spent at least five hours putting this castle together. Everything you see inside this castle came with a playset except the dolls. The first floor is so beautiful. I love the snowflake on the floor and the doorway right back here. This back door does not open and it's made out of a kind of clear blue glass. You can see Kristoff here sitting on a frozen couch. It has a glittery snowflake cushion and snowflakes on the back. And then over here is a sitting room. I really like all the furniture that came with this set and these windows are really neat too. I like the staircase and my really, really favorite thing is the light up chandelier. Oh, so Toby's favorite thing is this chandelier right here. Isn't that so pretty? It's supposed to be all blue, but my husband made it blue and white because he thought it looked better, and I agree. So all you do is press the button and it lights up. So let me turn off my lights so you can see it better. Oh, isn't that amazing? So beautiful. I kind of want to sing Let It Go right now. The fun thing about this staircase is that you can have your dolls race up the stairs. I need to get that go. Go, 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 go! Woohoo! Elsa won! Here's the second floor. Anna is in the kitchen. And there's one chair over there. The table that's cute and purple with snowflakes. And this adorable snowflake cake. And also there's this decorative snowflake. In the middle I have Elsa sitting on her throne. The chair has a tall back and a sparkly seat cushion. Then next to Elsa and her throne there's a dressing room. There's a chair, a nightstand, and this really cool armoire or like a dressing closet. The third floor is absolutely amazing. In the middle, we have this beautiful fountain. And I like this balcony too. Isn't that so pretty? Then there's Elsa's bedroom with a cute little snowflake bed. And look at Anna over here. Anna is looking in the mirror. And guess what? It lights up. Whoa, isn't that so pretty? Purple lights on the mirror. I wish I had a mirror like that at home. Then on the other side of the third floor, there's a piano, a lamp, and another mirror. And the lamp lights up. Yeah, and the lamp lights up too. So there's three light up things in this dollhouse. I haven't mentioned this yet, but this dollhouse is over three feet tall. There's even a fourth little story. There's Olaf. 
Nice wooden L lock came with the place set. Really cute. This is a fun secret hideout place for Olaf. All Toy Collector fans, I rate this dollhouse a 5 out of 5. It is so beautiful. I love the blue and purple colors. And it looks a whole lot like Elsa's Ice Palace in the movie. I rate like this dollhouse a Finity out of Finity. <laughs> out of Finity, yeah, because it is amazing. This is definitely one of my favorite kid craft dollhouses. The only negative thing about this dollhouse is that it takes a very long time to put together, so plan ahead. And I think that actually all kid craft dollhouses are built very well, but this dollhouse is not sturdy enough for your kid to sit inside. The particle board for this dollhouse is pretty thick and sturdy. But I could see it breaking if your kid tried sitting inside it. So it's probably for children ages 5 or 6 and up. Well, all toy collector fans, I was wondering, do you think this is the best dollhouse you have ever seen? Please write down what you think in the comments section. Also, if you want me to film more videos with this new Frozen Castle, please click like and subscribe. Goodbye! Also, please watch more of my fun videos!